All right, this one's for Chris here, and we're gonna do thirds, which we discovered were up at the 12th fret, look like this. Exercise doing both uh, down and up, and go. so it's uh, first string, second string, first string with middle index middle, and then the fifth string. That right there is the four eight notes you're looking for. One, two, three, I sped up. Okay, a little bit. So just kind of try to push yourself as you're going along, right? Once you get feel like you're there and you know it, then you can go ahead and try speeding it up. Uh, next thing we learned was a Don Reno scale on the G, which is uh, second finger uh, at the fifth fret, fourth string. And then we're going to go down on that, and then we're going to take our little finger, seventh fret, and we're going to come uh, fourth string, and we're going to come up. So it's like I'm going to go. On one string, we did this. So the right hand, you can see, is thumb, index, thumb, index, thumb, index, all the same string. So it sounds like a pick, right? Then you're going to do a scale, Reno style. And the last thing is this thumb index exercise for Scruggs Melody. It just kind of brings out drive and also makes your right hand uh, index finger totally independent. So it looks like I'm losing it as I get closer. So let's get back here. So, so I'm going to go thumb here is going to be on the third fret starting for the first time. Then each time you play this exercise, uh, I need you to move down like second finger, second fret, first finger, first fret, all in the fourth string and then open. So it's going to sound like this. That's it. That should do it, huh? Yep.